What's up guys? We are back for the fourth installment of the Legacy of Rosamund Hill game. Uh, different day, same outfit, it's the weekend, it's fine. Let's go ahead and get into part four, the Glen Mountain Championship. All right, first things first, let's go talk to Michael. Hey, Annie, I heard your horse is great. <laughs> of course. See you later. He walks so fast. Oh, my goodness. Where's John? I don't hear or see John. Let's go. Let's go this way. First things first. Hey, look, there's a key. I wonder where it goes. You don't have to hit any buttons to make that work. So now we go enter, no, Q, space bar. Can't really go anywhere or do anything in the house, but there's a letter. A letter? I wonder what it... Dear Steve, soon it's time for you to take over Rosemond Hill. You've always thought that I was wrong to take the estate from James Lawrence, and you've never really felt at home there. He was my best friend, and I lost his friendship because of money. This is something I've always regretted, and now it's too late to do anything about. But there is one thing that I would like to ask of you. James's wife, Louisa, was a fantastic horse rider. She won many championships, and she loved Roseman Hill more than anything. She pleaded to me that I would extend their loan, but I refused. In those days, business and money meant everything to me. I've seen Louise's granddaughter here on the estate, and she will become just as expert a horse rider as her grandmother. I want you to help her as much as you can so that she gets the same chance that she would have had if she had lived here on the estate. This would make me feel like I would be paying back the debt that I've had all these years. Your father. Louisa's granddaughter. That must be me. But what does it all mean? Thanks. I'll take a look at it. Don't know where John's vocals came from. And again, you can't go in there. Uh, don't. You gotta use the key to get out as well. Trying to see if I can hear where he's at. He's down there. Let's take a look. Oh, look, our sister is grooming and doing the stalls for us as well. It's good to practice a bit extra on the movements that didn't go so well in the last competition. Rude. I thought they went just fine. I'll have to go back in the videos because I didn't even check to see, do we always start at 25 on the storyline or does it get lower and lower each time? Who knows? Hey, there's Melissa's horse. Calm it, you're standing outside of your stall. You shouldn't be out there. I should put Melissa's horse in its stall. Thanks for taking care of my horse. No problem. See you later. So, first things first. Let's get Rocky and Comet outside. Walk freely here. So 
suppose we could have just put Comet outside, hey? But to complete the activity, he must go in a stall. Oh, and you know what? Now that I think about it, once he's in the stall, you can't get him out in this level. So we're going to just bloop, 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 put that back. All right, let's halter up our own horses. Before we do some of the activities, I think I'm going to do some chores for them so that we can get into that rotation a little bit faster. Hopefully it won't be as long. I think the last video was like 40 minutes. Don't want it to be that long. Well, that was easy. Chess is already at 100% health. <laughs> I've never seen that happen. Apples are not worth 50% of their health. That's so dumb. All right. So now that that's done, Let's read some articles. Here's the article from a young promising rider from Rosamond Hill Stables. 35 years ago, Annie Lawrence's grandmother was a renowned rider. Now it's Annie's turn. Experts believe that she has a brilliant future ahead and agree that if she takes her talent seriously and gives 100%, she will go far. The competition, however, is fierce, especially from Melissa Johnson, who also rides for the same stables and who has won a lot of competitions lately. But Annie also has talent and a strong horse. Annie has set her ambitions high. I won't stop until I've won the Kingswood Championships, she says confidently. I can't believe they wrote an article about me. I've lost my wallet. If found, please call 555 Six one seven three. So let's go find the wallet. It's in the shower, by the way. And I think it's interesting. Well, I guess I thought reading the article about her was. It's in the way back corner here. Someone has lost their wallet. Um, I thought reading the article contributed to the timeline, but it appears it does not. All right, I know it's five, 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 six, one. Ugh. Sorry, let me consult the notes because I already forgot. Mm -hmm. Seven, three. 
Enter. Hello. Hi, Michael. Guess what? I found your wallet. Great. Thanks a lot. I'll help you clean out your stalls. Oh, thank you. All right. We already had someone cleaning our stalls, but that's fine. Let's go upstairs. On to the next, maybe. Look. I, oh, that looks like my grandmother's old locket. She probably kept it in the bureau that used to be here. Hmm. It must have fallen out when they moved the bureau. I'm going to keep it. It's sure to bring me luck. Perhaps it will bring you luck. We need it after losing to Melissa. Like, what the hell was that about? All right, just wanted to check. You can either take Annie's sister's phone call in level three or level four. Um, either the phone answer after the reporter, or you can do it after you call Michael, I believe. Or before you call Michael. One of the two. Come here, Alpha. I do wonder too if like doing all of the chores pushes along the gameplay, but like if you don't accept people's help to do the chores, I don't think that pushes you along any further. What does Alpha want? Of course. The slowest horse wants to ride. That's fine. didn't even count. That's annoying. Alpha says, not today, folks. We're only at like 50% health. Oh, that's right. Melissa has disappeared. Can you ride out to the cross country track and look for her? I forgot about Melissa. She's by the third fence. Do yourself a favor and do not go through the start gate. Just go normal. You don't need to do the fences. Wow, look at how slow we're going. Oh my gosh. Hope Melissa's not having a heart attack because we ain't gonna be there anytime soon. Poor Alpha. He's just so slow and old. Okay. So Comet's up here. Also, Comet's not wearing any tack. Oh, that's also why you can't let Melissa's horse out this season. Or this episode, this whatever it's called. Are you hurt? Thanks for coming out looking for me. My foot is hurt. But if you help me up, I think I'll be able to ride home. Of course I will, and I'll ride back to Rosamond Hill with you. Rosamond Hill. Faster, faster. Really sure why Melissa's there. Annie, I've got to go. Could you please 
give this note to John? It's very personal. I'd love to. Thanks for your help. Oops. I would love to give you the note. I would love, no, words. I would love to give the note from you to the man that I love. Do you know what I think? I think you're ready to compete now. Okay. Here's a message from Melissa. Thanks. Do you know what I think? I think you're ready to compete now. I don't. Okay. It's probably because chess is at 100% health, but like, I ain't fucking with that. Come on, Alpha. All right, let's go get Monster. Monster the Monster. He's sweaty from running around with chess. Come on, Chess. Nice horse. All right, cool. Let's go sweep the aisle. I don't have much commentary today. I'm really tired and I just kind of want to finish this series. Just because it's a lot of editing work and stuff, so. Come here, Alpha. Alpha? How's Alpha only at 65? How? I don't understand. Come on, monster. Come to mommy. No, too far. Let John pass, because we don't want him to say unsolicited things to us. Opened a door by accident. It's the ghosts. Just like the ghosts dropping the hay on the floor that I just swept. Absolute garbage.
Chess wants a shower, and I'm thinking I'm going to throw a saddle on her. She's the biggest of the horses that we've gotten so far, and I just want to see what she's like riding. Perhaps Monster will be replaced, though. Again, I think it was a fluke because Monster is like doing the fastest course times out of literally any of the horses that I've had on this game. Look at that, you can tack up in the wash stall. Do you know what I think? I think you're ready to compete now. Okay. I think you're ready to stop talking to me. my cat's food. Sorry. Thank you for the nice performance. I mean, she's pretty fast. This is for shits and giggles. Let's go to... The problem is when they're fast and big. They can be a lot harder to control on the bounces. Almost got lost there for a second. Like in doing the controls, I don't feel she's any faster than Monster. I do prefer the smaller horses. Thank you for the nice performance. Like I think that's pretty average. I think Monster got like 20. So see, it is going up every time we do a course. So maybe we have to do all three help with gameplay, even though it's not required. See, and then on this cross country, she feels so slow. There's a bit of a lag. Oh shit. Well, that don't help either. See, it's harder to steer the big horses. Like, I'm just so much more comfortable with Monster. Sad thing is, even with that little turnaround, she's probably going to be faster time than Alpha. The other thing I think too is pretty much if you go clear, you're either going to be first or second in all the competitions. So even if you had a turnaround, um, because the there's no optimal time, if you like go over a fence and it doesn't register, I think you can still place second. You'll have time, like a slower time than Melissa, but you can still place second. Nope, can't put them here with the saddle on. So you can tack up in the wash stall, but you cannot untack in the wash stall. Good to know. I think we're just gonna leave old chess inside for now. Alpha, where are you broski? We gotta, oh yeah, you'll get an apple and then you'll be at 100%. 
Then all we're waiting on is Monster. Still not even a hundred. Whatever, man. You do you. <laughs> Where is monster go over here? Come here, monster. We might be able to hit 100 in this part. Once we get all the horses to 100. Yeah, chess at 100% is just like the same as monster at 70. He's smaller, he can do the tighter turns. Yeah, he's faster than chess. See, because she's at 100%, I don't think it adds any value. Nice horse. All right. Now we play the weight game. Yeah, you know in the last part when I said part three is when I do the most riding and then I proceeded to have one ride in part three and that was it? Yeah. Prime example of that not being the case because here we are on like our fourth ride. To be fair, Chess's ride was not asked for. I just wanted to see how she would go. We must have just like missed, like done too fast of gameplay for the last chapter because I was making some hella shortcuts, hella shortcuts in that competition. Like ones I've never made before to get a faster time. That's just crazy to me. 
All right, alpha's at 100. Mm, I don't think we're gonna make it to 100 on the gameplay. Once we get, I think we'll just get a couple of points from getting monster up to 100% health, and then I think that's as far as it'll go. Disgusting. Ride again? Fucking alpha. You don't need this much exercise. 100%. Do not. You know what I think? I think you're ready to compete now. I think you should be quiet. Come on. The only thing I'm willing to do with alpha is the show jumping because he's so slow. Nope, missed it. That's a shame. Faster, faster. He's just all over the place. Thank you for the last performance. Twenty six seconds. Pitiful. Pitiful. Again, I don't know how I did that. Literally? No. Here you go. I think he's only at 95% health. Oh, he is at 100. Wonderful. 
Let's go get chess and then we'll save the game, call it a day. Come on, chess. Of course she wants to be ridden, because why wouldn't she? So I think we're going to have to play through one more round of chores, because no doubt by the time I get back with chess, Alpha's going to want something, and then by the time I'm done with Alpha, Monster's going to want something, and it's just going to be a whole ordeal. Come on, let's see what you got. So 95 is the highest we got this section of the game, which I, I still don't get. Again, if anybody knows how that gameplay monitor works, like, let me know. actually pretty fast. I don't know guys, what do you think? Should we give Chess a chance? Should we give Monster a show break? I'm just a little bit worried how many times I'm gonna have to do the show jumping. Because what you haven't seen is all the times and the reason you save before you go to the show, all the times I've had to escape out of the competition and go back to my, save, my saved game at the mailbox and start over so that I could put on a good show for you guys. Actually, Alpha doesn't need anything. So while we're ahead, let's just get out of here, save our game and go to this competition. Maybe I should have brought Racky in because he's out all by himself now. But that's okay because it's a computer game. All right, so we're gonna save our game in our spot and we'll come back for the competition. All right guys, let's get back into competition. Fuck it, let's take chess. The day for the Glen Mountain Championships is finally here. The entire program will be ridden at the intermediate level, and it proves to be a real challenge for all of the equestrians and horses who will participate. Jumping, steeplechase, and cross country must all be completed successfully. We wish good luck to all of the competitors. That felt so slow though, you guys. I I don't know.
Thank you for the nice performance. All right, so you have to be careful on that last fence because the fence itself does not line up with the end. And if you don't go through the end gate, the timer will not stop. I feel like this is going so slow, but it's telling me it's the fastest and we're beating Melissa. I don't know. It's just, none of this is adding up to me. Ride up to me and make a halt in front of me so that I can examine the horse's health and fitness. I will be fairly quick. I'm going to check the pulse and see whether the steeplechase has caused any injuries. You Apparently I'm pushing the horse too hard. But it's because it feels like she's barely moving. Oh my god. Forgot how terrible the tracks are here. I feel like there's a fence. Ooh, there are so many fences. Ooh. We are cruising. The tracks definitely get harder to follow as you go. In the steeplechase, obviously, you could see. Um, there was a lot of duplication of trails. Ooh. Oh, I knew that one was coming. You gotta be really careful with these hills. Oh, where's the path, where's the path? Glen Mountain is so hilly, it's just terrible. If you're ever not sure of where you're going, double check that your green dot on the bottom of the screen is still moving. If it's still moving, you're headed in the correct direction. If it stops moving, you've somehow gotten off the path. I have to admit, you're not so bad after all. Who do we want to pick for our new horse? We are definitely replacing, I personally never replace Alpha because he's the gift horse, right? So let's replace Chess because she won, but she wasn't like super great. Um, patient, <laughs> we don't want horses that say patient. So winner is out. Lady says not fast, so we're not gonna even bother. Queen says fast but needs a great deal of care. Millie is headstrong. Bianca is hot-tempered. She's the smallest horse we would own at this point. Fast and fearless. And then Diamond is a big old stallion. I don't know who I want to try. I think we're gonna go with Diamond. I have to admit that I've become pretty good at riding. Melissa is also good, and there's going to be a competition between us. I don't like to lose, but Melissa gets really mad if she's not the best. It's kind of hard. We'll see how it goes in the Kingswood Championships. I ran into Mr. Willoughby, and he said that he thought that I have a good chance of winning. 
and then he said something that I didn't quite understand. If you win, you will have proved where you really belong. I wonder what he meant by that. All right, guys, that's it. We are done with the Kings, or we're on to Kingswood Championship. Part five will be coming soon. Remember to save your game, and we'll catch you guys in the next one.